And... Yeah, let's go. So welcome to the fourth match of this season. Uh, against Ihand, still I have an amazing record so far this season. I hope that I can continue this. Um, the only village is Bustling Village, right? No draw. Patrician is the only draw. Hmm. Doesn't look that amazing. You kind of want to get a gladiator and get a fortune, maybe. I'm not sure what to do. I think I open Lighthouse Ambassador. Ironworks is also nice. Ironworks Ambassador. To be able to get all those settlers and bustling villages later, buying bustling villages maybe, or patricians, and then get Aporium points. Yeah, let's get an Ironworks. It seems worth it. There's so many cheap stuff you kind of want. He gets Lighthouse instead. Yeah, I can see Lighthouse. I consider that as well. I will buy one here. So let's see what he gets. He gets second ambassador. So should I gain a second ambassador here then? Or should I just gain two lighthouses and be defended? Another option is seller to play my one lighthouse on my ironworks more often. Seller seems amazing as well. A gladiator, I don't think I want yet. I'm not sure what to do gain here. Is it really worth it to get a second ambassador with also a chunk dealer maybe? Although it's kind of tricky to get to five. Uh, I'm really not sure what to do here. It doesn't seem worth it to uh, see worth it to get a chunk uh, second ambassador. I will get a seller and get a lighthouse. I think I'd rather play my one ambassador each turn, if somehow possible. Not sure what he thinks here. Let's hope he doesn't have an ambassador in hand. And his ambassador misses. That would be amazing. No, okay. Oh, I can get a junk dealer. Yeah, let's get that. That's just really good. He gets settlers. Um, so... When did I shuffle? This is Ironworks Ambassador and Estate. So I think I sell her Copper Copper Estate. Ironworks as Settlers. And Ambassador True Estates. like it so far. Uh, let's play Lighthouse again. It's great, it's in the beginning of the shuffle. Kind of want the second Lighthouse now. 
ambassador the estate and buy another settlers oh if he buys the settlers now i definitely will get the busting village no that's sad now oh, well, let's get a gold This is kind of terrible here. There is an estate there. Oh uh, yeah, still I have to do that. Settlers. Uh, I kind of want to sell her that one copper. Oh, now I can't ambassador anything. I think I want a second seller here. No, let's get the settlers. This. Yeah, I have a good chance hitting five next turn. Yeah, I'm not sure why uh, I like his second ambassador. It doesn't really make a lot of sense. I'm not sure, even sure if you want an ambassador at all, honestly. Gladiator makes sense as well. I could gain one here. And I could get a province, but I think that's too early. Let's get a bustling village. So he has no estate, I could reveal estate here. Lighthouse, settlers, take, bustling village, gladiator, reveal estate, and take another bustling village. Mainly that I can buy, get patricians and that those patricians maybe draw the bustling village and bustling village draw settlers so I can get a little bit of draw. Okay, I don't have a lighthouse in play. I don't think I want more lighthouses though. I think I get a second gladiator now. No, that's stupid. Let's get Patricia now. I'm not sure if this is right, but yeah, let's do it anyway. Settler seller is a nice combination also. So he's really thin, but I have a much better deck, I think. Yeah, I'll reveal. He gets the last bustling village, I assume. I think I got free though. Maybe. So, settlers. Let's see my deck. I have four, five coppers. Should try to get rid of some. Okay. Uh, let's play chunk dealer first. Get rid of a copper. Then, seller. 
these two coppers. I should have just got the settlers as well. well take copper, bustling village, lighthouse, lighthouse. <clears throat> yeah, I should have discarded the uh, settler, uh, settlers as well. Do I need a second junk dealer? No, I don't think so. Lighthouse collided as again. I just get a gold. Yep, I have a patrician in hand. I think he is ahead, but I still think I, I'm fine. I have a much better deck. His deck isn't able to do a whole lot. Look at that. That's, that's not a lot he can do. Yeah, he can just get more gladiators. That's all he can do. Okay, let's play patrician first. Oh, nice. Um, unfortunately, this means I can't, there's still, I think I need another seller. Take settlers. Take settlers. I want to gain another seller here. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. Let me think about what I can do here. Can, if I can get to 8, I can get a fortune this turn. Yeah, and I can easily do that. So let me play Gladiator and reveal Estate. He doesn't have an Estate. Okay. So do I seller stuff? What do I have here? That there's a chunk dealer in there. Does he has a, he has a lighthouse in play, so it's not really worth it. Let's sell her these three. Exactly, and ambassador these two coppers. do that <laughs> he reveals every time <laughs> other thing I have in hand that's re really amazing uh, don't reveal so he can get a fortune now as well Okay, let's see. I think a chunk dealer first. Um, okay, let's discard these two. Patrician. Okay, that's nice. Bustling Village. Okay. Uh, if I gain a silver, I don't think that's worth it. In any case, it's not worth it. Let's uh, gain a Patrician here.
And just go for province here, I think. Because he has no ambassador, right? Yeah. He has a very, th very thin deck, he could be, uh, which means he gets a couple of turns where he can generate a lot of money. But the problem is that he would stall pretty soon, I think, while I have a couple of goals. Or something, he even stalls now. So I think I only play light one lighthouse and sell all the other things. And I sell all the settlers. Or do I? Yeah, I sell all the settlers. So one, two, three. Okay, now I can get draw. And take the copper. Okay, and continue. Uh, yeah, I need... That, that has to go. Uh, I don't think he has any coppers. Only five coppers and then trash? Oh, they are our, our uh, ambassador. Uh, okay, I don't. I only have one buy, so let's just get a province here. I think I might sell her the, the ironworks. <laughs> so 20 and 2 buys, yeah. That's of course very good. Okay, um, bustling village, take settlers. Settlers, take copper. Patrician. Nice, okay. Let's Patrician first again. Yes, nice, okay. This is really good. I really want a double province here. Let's play Cellar. Although, what do I... I need a third buy somehow. He has only two buys and he has no ironworks. I think I have to gain a, an estate here. Uh, that's... I have to play the lighthouse, although he has no attack anymore. Yeah, let's get rid of that lighthouse. Although... Yeah, let's do this. And I have 8 and 16 to be able to double province. Okay, let's play Lighthouse. Uh, Feardom, uh, there's no silver, so... Okay. 
Okay. I just want a clean shuffle, do I? Or what are the last cards in here? There's a chunk dealer in here. Chunk dealer. Um, I'm not even sure what is in there. Gladiator. I kind of want to keep the gladiator. But there's no seller in there and kind of want to have a seller. Let's continue. A bustling village, yeah. Uh, that's four cards. Let's do settlers. I drew another gold. Do I just want sh just a clean shuffle here? Chunk dealer and gladiator are still in there. I think I want a clean shuffle here. And and actions. Oh, that's t terrible. That's of course terrible. He can probably should get like Emporium and something. Come on, this is just terrible. Okay, if I draw another gold, I'm not terribly fine, but... Okay, I need to gain another state to keep the turn alive. That's just stupid. Okay, if I get province, I have uh, 34. Yeah, that should be still good. No, 32. I miscalculated, but I should still should still be fine. Okay, I win. Whew. Yeah, I think double ambassador was not great here. Okay, edit table, advanced options, player order. Oh. He was starting player, right? Yeah, he opened. Pretty sure he was starting player. Okay. Goons, Mountain Pass, Lost City. Okay, counterfeit. Forager. Mm, I definitely want money here. Some way, I'm not sure. Although you still want the Forager. I think Forager Silver. And hope to get to five. And get Lost City and Goons as fast as possible. Mountain Pass is probably irrelevant.
Overgrown Estate helps hitting 5 with Forager. Yeah, like this. If I draw a Copper here, I'm fine. Although I'm helping him, of course, to hit 5. Will he get second Forager here? Or Silver? No, Silver as well. Yeah, Lost City. Uh, I'm just hoping he gets a Lost City here as well and helps me here out. Although I can only hit 4 anyway. So yeah, then it doesn't matter. I can just end actions, get another Forager. Another option would have been, of course, counterfeit. Uh, but I think that's a waste of time. With two foragers. So I hope he gets Lost City as well. No, he gets goons. Okay. Should I get a third forager? No, I get just a silver, I think. Okay, that was nice. So he can goons me here, I don't really care. Okay. This will be a great turn, yes. And I think I'm already in the winning position here. Nine. I think I get a second goons here and a silver. Oh, I hope he gets a lost city. Uh. Okay, that was sad, but okay. He gets second, so let's get like two lost cities here. Not yet. That was still a sad turn. Oh wow. Okay, that was glad that I drew that lost city. Still, I couldn't get to double lost city, that's kind of sad. And I don't want storeroom. And I don't want another forager, and I don't want another silver. So he gets the last lost city, of course, and he gets the storeroom. So one, two, three, four, okay, I got five. And, okay, now exactly two goons. And, now just getting artificers, I assume, or courtiers. Uh, I can get rid. No, let's. 
get rid of the foragers. They don't me do me a lot of good now. Sure, let's trash that silver and play four goons. Okay, what should I buy? Kind of want to use all my buys somehow. But that doesn't work, of course. I'm not sure what to do. Artificer. Artificial silver, goon silver. Can I draw everything? That will be quite kind of hard. I think I'd rather have another artificer than another goons. Do I want a copper? I don't think so. Um, oh, that's fortunate. Can I end it? He resigns? Cool. I'm glad because I don't know how to do the end game in this game. <laughs> Cool, uh, the table, advanced options, player order, e hunt first, and ready. Okay, black market. Stonemason with alchemist. Scavenger, stables, no trashing. Bishop is trashing, stonemason trashing, so no, no good trashing. Colony game, yeah, you have to open black market here, black market potion. And hope to get a good trasher here. Also no village, so getting a village is also kind of a big deal. Okay, what do I get for four? I think another black market. Oh, potion misses. Mm, Paul Diver. I can't overpay for Alchemist. Herald is good. Apothecary could work. 
I don't want an armory, I don't want a farmer's market. Said you can't overpay to, for two apothecaries here. Yeah, I think I get apothecary here. And a pearl diver. He can top deck. It's really good. Oh, and this is just brutal. I think I'm already lost. Maybe I should have picked up a courtyard, but this would be my third terminal. Get silver. I'm not sure about that. This is just terrible, but what should I want from that? Okay, at least he can't overpay for two. Uh, I can't either. Okay, Masquerade, right? Crossroads is very good as well. Uh, but Masquerade is very good against this Alchemist. Yeah, let's get one. Crown is also very good. But I can't get that. Now to hopefully get a... Uh, I don't have an Alchemist in place, so... No need to continue playing. Now he has to be careful with top taking his alchemist. That's very, very strong, I think, here. Besides the fact that, of course, I can trash. Stone isn't for stables. Wow, yeah, he's just so far ahead. Uh, top deck this. So, do I play Masquerade or Black Market? I think I play Black Market here, just to get a village, and I didn't get one. I get just unlucky with those Black Market here. I really need to trash as well, but I think a village would have been very uh, stronger here. And he nearly draws his deck already. I'm sorry if I'm breathing loudly or something. Uh, it's still very hot, and I closed the window because I uh, don't want to stream with the neighbors. Maybe getting annoyed by the voice here as it's getting late already. I don't talk loudly, but still. Uh, he Forager, yeah, that's very good. And Double Alchemist. Yeah, I'm so far behind. I can get Double Alchemist here as well. But I can get a Golem. I think that's more important. Although Double Alchemist is also very good. But I think I need the village here. My only hope is that he top decks alchemists and has to give me one or, some, or, some, or something good to my to masquerade. Yeah, he has five alchemists. Uh, let's hope he top decks all of them. I'm just so far behind. That's just brutal.
What did he get? He, he just gets all the alchemists. Okay. I, st I think he has seven of them, yeah. He top tech, so he missed that. Okay, now I only need to find Masquerade. Top tech that. No. Now stables. Come on! Where's my Masquerade? Um, no, still don't want to top deck that. Oh, come on, this was unbelievable. Uh, okay, Stone Mason for Alchemist. So let's hope he top decks this time all five alchemists again. Uh, let's trash the cobra, I want to give him an estate. No, he top decks three this time. Oh, I'm stupid! This, uh, this was too much. I forgot about stables. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, this was just too much. <laughs> okay. Uh, advance options. Player order. <laughs> How could st stupid can I be? I forgot totally about stables. Okay, let's see. Bandit forward, which means we don't need one copper, uh, silver and golds, right? Yeah. Oh, where's draw? Hailing is draw. Shantytown can be draw. Villa, but without draw. So we have all the villages like Shantytown, Fishing Village, Villa. They're safe. If I wanted to, I could save something. Honestly, with no draw besides of Hailing, Cotier is a decent option to open with. What else should, should I open with? The, the other options that seem so worth w w worse. I could open. I could save. No, that seems stupid. Got here, and then here save a copper, and just gain golds. Farmer's market, that's weird, okay. Weird opening, I would say. Okay, let's... Let's just action. Isn't this... Split pile, isn't the... Special K, okay. Uh, okay. So hireling and fishing village is what I want. Okay, let me reveal an estate and gain a gold and buy a fishing village. Wow, he heavily goes for farmer's market. Okay, that's also... Uh, let, I should still want fishing villages first. Uh, I'm not sure what he's trying for. Contraband? What? 
Okay, oh. uh, for peddler, yeah. I get more fishing villages. Where's my courtier? Did I? I forgot save to do to do a save the last couple of times. So yeah, farmers market because of peddler. But peddler, I don't deny. I deny hireling here. Okay, I see. I didn't see that interaction. Gain a gold, all to play, hireling. But gaining all those villas seems terrible though. Why do I have minus four victory points? Did I buy something? Oh, bandit fort. I totally forgot that again. And our shanty town. So let's not gain more goals. Uh, I'm just losing uh, focus here. Yeah, he's gaining him gaining all. Uh, let's gain one more gold and get a hireling. He gets all the peddlers, of course. Yeah, I missed I missed that interaction totally. Uh four, five, six. I can't save anything. Will you get just for... Oh, it's a colony. I also forgot that it's a colony board. Yeah, he gets just platinum, okay. Hiling Shantytown. Five, six, seven, save. Hiling. <clears throat> okay, <laughs> yeah, I'm losing this one. I'm definitely losing this one. I just missed all the interactions here to get plus buys for peddlers, which seems a very, uh, very decent strategy here. Uh, definitely want another hireling here. Another platinum, yep. Yeah. Uh, Coutier reveal fishing village. Now coins and buy. Okay, I want the hireling here. 
Let me get Hiling Shantytown. <clears throat> so, but he has only two Hilings in play. I have three of them in play. And I think I want the Hiling split 6 4. So, I think I still have a decent chance. Um, Colony, I think. He just gets another Platinum, I assume. He gets Farmer's Market and tries to empty on Pires, okay. Then let me quickly get a Colony, I assume. So he wins now here. Okay, wow. That did totally not go as I expected. Well played. So 2-2, two, two, right? Okay. Boy, it's hot in here. Okay, um, University Haunted Woods is probably the best thing you can do. Also, there's Mining Village Enchantress for draw. Um, ba -ba -ba, Urchin Swindler seems very good. Wall is also there. Ferry is there, wow. You can ferry on Forge and gain Forge with University. He has 5 too, which is terrible. Good chance in colliding. Here I will get another. Uh, although I have to put back. No, it decreases my chance. Let's buy Ferry. It's on a card, right? Yeah, so Ferry. Is there plus buy? But it just makes the most sense to put it on Forge. Oh, sad. He gets a forge. Okay, curse. I got a forge. Okay, uh, he played oh, again. That's just stupid. <laughs> Not sure if I should have done that. Probably shouldn't have bought anything. And this works again perfectly for him. He has already a thin deck. Yeah, well, this is again like game over. Swindler is my best hope to hit something. Also, I can use Mercenary as an attack here. He played a Haunted Woods, right? Yeah, let's not... Let's put Fairy... Is there... Doesn't make sense to put Fairy on anything.
But he plays now Haunted Woods every turn. Oh my. I'm getting terribly outplayed now. Swindler though is a real threat. Oh, university? Really? I wanted to hit something differently. Portion. Procession Swindler. Wow. I'm just getting seriously outplayed. Uh, I'm not sure if I should resign, but this is just terrible. Oh, come on! He gives me the potion again. And gives me another potion. Why? Why did he give me the potion? This seems just weird. He trashed my swindler? So I have nearly no cards in my deck that are somehow useful. <laughs> hey, I'm winning with four points. Uh, I think I can resign, let's just continue though. So this is my deck. I'm not sure how I can still win this. At least university is safe from Getting swindled. Okay, this is my only hope with university to come back. Okay, let's see. How can I win this? Uh, so, University gain a Haunted Woods. University gain a Swindler. Actions, procession, I have a very, th a very thin deck that helps me as well. <laughs> Because of war. I need... 
I'm not giving up yet. Okay. This. 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 Okay, silver. Oh, that's for me. I was confused for a second. That's a Vining Village. And buy a Swindler again. Okay. I should draw every everything. So procession on mining village is pretty solid. But he just empties provinces before I can do anything, it looks like. Yeah. Okay. He... I don't want to process, I don't have a portion, so uni haunted woods uni procession procession the mining village crash okay get another haunted woods Okay, let me attack mercenary, curse this. Procession, uh, swindler. Okay, let gi let's give him harvests, silver. And I need to gain another mining village. Haunted Woods, Haunted Woods, Province. Maybe I can still win? It, I doubt it. Uh, as soon my, as my Swindler hits Province, it's game over and it's already game over. Yeah, that was brutal. Oh, oh wow, minion, uh, minion knight's chapel. Five two is of, of course very good. Magpie just uh, to defend against those knights. I think that's the best way to do it. Okay, he gains silver first. And here I buy a silver, but I already have two magpies. That's very good. Potion? No, potion. I think I like uh, my deck so far. Okay, first damn uh, minion. Just to be able to hit knights regularly. I don't want to trash my necro. Oh, they molly. Yeah, I want they mo not molly. Okay, that's nice. Uh, yeah, let's pray Necro. 
minion for two coins, chapel for that, and get day molly. Okay, and now, now I have a very, very th uh, great deck. Uh, of course, that's terrible. Now I don't have enough money, but I can get all the magpies. Okay, he gets all the knights now, and I will get... What? Oh, it's in the trash. Okay. Still, I should be fine. Okay, I still should be fine. I have all the magpies as buffer. Okay, and actions. Damn Josephine. Okay, where's the last copper? Okay. Okay, I want to get rid of that James Josephine anyway. And and action Sir Michael. Okay. Nah, I don't want him to get that. Oh, that plus buy a knight is though very good. I rather wanted Servander. I want to keep that. And treasure silver, that's nice. So two piles already empty. Secret passage. Okay, so Michael. Oh, so Michael's gone. Trash the secret passage. Okay, now minion. In turn. So how many magpies do I still have? Four? Okay. Okay, that's gone now. How many are in the trash now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So he has still two. That's terrible. Treasure is treasure is nice. But I do that. What did happen? What did happen? Nothing. Good, good. Um so how does this game end?
Let's discard. Sell all this. And get another minion. Okay, so that's the last pile. <laughs> I'm not sure how this is supposed to go. I'm not... Oh, I'm getting more minions. For sure. I was star player. So he gets province now. Okay. Sell her those two magpies. I trashed the minion. Uh no. So losing the night split, uh, split was of course terrible because he hit my silver. I think he hit my silver? And there goes another minion, so this is just game over. Okay, I can do this. Okay. Uh, I need to attack him. I don't have enough money, right? Uh, I try something. I know it's stupid, but let's get a hundred crowns and hope he trashes it. <laughs> okay, it's game over. Yeah, that. Now after a great start, uh, it w just went downhill. I'm not sure what went wrong here. So let's have a look at the chat. Yeah, so Vander was really good. I l would have liked to have him. So, secret passage? How can secret passage count or knights? I don't understand. To put something in your next hand? Okay, uh, anyway, thanks for watching. I will stay in the chat a little bit if you want to hang out and see you around. Bye.